celebrity tattoos celebrities that have gone under the needle celebrities the first the first person that we're going to critique and give our opinion my opinion about um is Lil Wayne Lil Wayne I mean looking at his tattoos is, is he smoking a fag there? What has he even got on? Has he even got pants on? Judging by a look at the uh, by a look at his tattoos I would say I think he got a lot of them when he was young I think what's that say fear God on his eyes? Mm, yeah fair one. I think he went for like I think he went I think he went hard. I mean, they've stayed in. It looks like he's just gone in to a studio or his mates come around his house and he's just been like, yo, I'm in a gang. We're in the gang. I want you to tow me. And uh, I feel like having bang on my body is good. I feel like mob on my chest is, is great. It's good. I, I, I love the mob life. Cash money on my stomach is lit. He's just gone fucking nuts, to be honest. It kind of suits him. I mean, can you imagine Lil Wayne without no tattoos? Let's just have a little look here. It just doesn't look right. It doesn't. Wait, what? Emma Watson's got a tattoo. I don't even know this. That can't be real. Is that real? It looks fake, but I don't know if it is. It could be real. It could be real. It could also be fake. She looks like she's 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 in a beer garden, and uh, she's got mother lover on her shoulder. Damn, that's a statement. Nah, she didn't get that. Hermione, no, Hermione. What the fuck, Hermione? No, what the fuck, man? Moving on. <laughs> Stevo, Stevo, Stevo. Uh, fucking hell, he's got a portrait on his back of himself. <laughs> That's like, that's like me going to, to a tattooist with a portrait of myself going, yo dude, I want this on my back big. I want it big and I want to fucking have it signed by myself. On my back. By myself. On my back. No. Why? Why? It's not a bad bit of work. You know, the shading is good. It's smooth, black should be where the black should be, light shade should be where the light shade should be. So, stayed in well, it's healed well, and to do a tattoo that big anyway is quite tricky to get it all smooth and nice. So, was it a dare? Was it a dare? I, I, was it a dare? Was it? A pretty savage dare, to be honest, if, if it was. Moving on! Ah! Moving on. Chris Brown. Chris Brown's our next one. C Breezy. Chris B. Chrissy B. Uh, Chris Brown, what the fuck? Um, the fuck is this? I mean, it looks like uh, it looks like Rihanna, to be honest. And I don't know if it is Rihanna, but uh, when he got that and he first went on this red carpet event, uh, people were like, "What the fuck has he got on his neck? Is that Rihanna?" Uh, and I think it was soon after he he uh, beat her up in his in his Lamborghini. I think it was like a m memorial to her. I mean, it's sh it's not great. I, I I don't I don't rate it at all. I don't rate the artwork at all. I think it's fucking awful to be honest and to have it on your neck I mean <laughs> I had some really shit fucking word on my neck um, but I got it covered for all you that know me you know or all you that have seen me up close it's, you can still see it in the hair in the hair you can still see it in the hair of the girl we've all got tattoos that we regret we've all got tattoos that we want to change and we've all got tattoos that we want covered let's face it but credit where it's due I think on the other side of his neck he has a like a lion, uh, traditional lion going on with like a headdress. That's pretty sick. I've seen that. That's sick. Um, see Breezy, Chris Brown, Chris Brown, Chris Brown. Hey, 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 everybody. Chris Brown. Uh, moving on. Uh, Mike Tyson. Mike, the Beast Tyson. Uh, is that is that his real is that his real uh, stage name, the Beast, or did I just make that up? I think I just made it up. I can't turn anymore. <laughs> Mike Tyson, this tattoo, his face tattoo. I don't know if he's got any tattoos anywhere else, but it's pretty obvious that he's got a face tattoo. I mean, look at it. Fuck. He 
he has clearly gone into a studio and said, I don't give a fuck anymore, I don't care, so I'm gonna get some fat tribal on my face. Each their own, mate. I wouldn't want to fucking say, look, Mike, mate, come on. You got a shit tattoo, because he'll probably go, you know what I mean? <laughs> Mike Tyson, everybody. Round of applause for Mike Tyson. Okay, moving on. Okay, Justin, Justin. It's just Justin. <laughs> Not Justin Timberlake, Justin Bieber, all right? Justin Bieber. Justin fucking Bieber. Justin Bieber. I, 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 I kind of like his tattoos. It's a bit like mix and match. Like all these celebrities we've looked at so far, they haven't really thought about like a, a theme or they've just basically got random tattoos, random tattoos, random tattoos and then just filled them together, you know, with clouds or some shit. And I hate that. I, I hate that. I, I personally won't do clouds unless it's really realistic. Justin Bieber's is well done, the most well done because they're done really nice, they're smooth, they are what they are. They're very traditional. They're kind of realistic, but kind of not. Uh, the clouds aren't realistic at all. I think they're done well and they suit him, to be honest. Um, the cross on his chest is cool. Um, I probably wouldn't have had the crown on the top and the Roman numerals on the top either, if they are ro Roman numerals, I don't know. I would have probably gone for a sick chest piece with the cross in the middle, but each to their own, I guess. I think a lot of his have been uh, meaningful. I think a lot of his mean something to him, which is which is cool, that's nice. So if you can get a tattoo that looks cool and means something, great. So let's have a look at another one. Rihanna. Rihanna, Rihanna, Rihanna. Rihanna's tattoo on her hand, she, uh, it looks like she's had a cover up of some, or laser sessions on, uh, some arrows or something on her hand. I'm not sure where she got that done, but I know for a fact where she got her like henna style stuff from, and that was Callie Jo. Callie's done a really good job to be fair, because hands are hard to tattoo. I actually tattooed a hand today. Um, and they are hard to tattoo. They are really hard to tattoo. So to have it healed, over the knuckles especially, because they're really hard to stay in, unless you know what the fuck you're doing and how deep you're gonna go without blowing it. It's, it's healed nice. Looks like she's, she's got some on her fingertips as well and around her wrist as well. And to be honest, imagine Rihanna or uh, Chris Brown coming, coming to you, or Drake even, coming to you and saying, bro, Ollie, I want a tattoo from you. I want to do this. I want to do that. I want to do this. Design anything you want. Fucking smash it on me. I'll be fucking shitting myself. I'll be so nervous. I'll be like dripping with sweat. I'd probably need to bring four different t-shirts to that session because I would need a lot of fucking t-shirts, spare ones, because I'll be dripping with sweat. That'd be pretty nerve-wracking. And. I, I, I take my hat off to Cali for smashing it and uh, doing a good job, to be honest, um, <clears throat> in the grand scheme of things. So, Rihanna, ladies and gentlemen, that's my view on some celebrity tattoos. Just think about what you're gonna get, man. Think about what you wanna get. And look into your artist as well. I've had comments and uh, customers come to me and they're like, I want this, I want that, exactly how it is. I'm like, bro, cool. I, you know, I'll take some ideas from that design and from this reference and from this reference, put my twist on it and create something new for you. And then they like go away, they come back and they're like, nah, I want it exactly like this. I want it exactly like that. And it's like, bro, bro, have some fuck originality here have some have some originality the fuck is this it's been an eventful it's been an eventful video it's been emotional but for now i'm gonna have to love you and leave you all because i've got shit to do and give me a comment and let me know if and what you want me to talk about tattoo related if you have any questions or queries um, that you want me to do a video on. I will do that for you people. Peace and love guys. I will see you in the next video. Take care of yourselves, you motherfuckers.